please direct your attention to the Traumatron for this tale of open road misery. The school bus driver in Indiana allowing the kids to drive the school bus Stop. while other students were on board. What? It's all good, it's all good. I'm letting her stop it, Michael, stop. Don't stay on the road, don't. <laughs> Don't you tell all the other adults about this? Okay. Uh, I don't know, that's pretty awesome. Wow. <laughs> I wish that guy was my school bus driver. This bus driver was, I believe the expression in America is hella fired. Yeah. <laughs> so everyone, for $2,000, you have to talk it through and lock in where you think getting fired for letting children drive a school bus lands on the misery index. Nobody got hurt. Yeah, no one he, He's not gonna drive a bus again. You lose your job, but you have to deal with the parents, right? They're gonna all come after you. But he could work at McDonald's or something. Like, you could Right, I mean, he just has a driver's license. Okay, everyone, I'm gonna need you now to lock in your answers and tell me where you think this lands on the misery index. Boom, boom. Good man. And so is Renee. Good, good answer. Everyone's locked in. <laughs> Let's see who has mastered the misery by being closest to the oh, correct answer. Renee? You have said letting children drive your school bus lands at a... 44. And Albert, yeah. you have said it lands at a... 56. How are you both feeling, Albert and Renee? Oh, I feel like I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> <laughs> Projectile vomit. <laughs> if if Renee throws up, <laughs> it is with 100% certainty that I'm also throwing up. <laughs> Thanks for your support. And me. Oh, but how's, how's your stomach? I've never been this nervous in my entire life. <laughs> really? Quite literally. OK. Albert and Renee, let's see what our shrinks say. I want Alan to play for that big money. Albert is moving on where he will be playing for the $30,000 grand prize.